What's going on guys? Mike here. You guys also know me as Bear Ghost. I'm bringing you this video here today because I've been getting a lot of people asking what my setup is for the computer, um, what I run, because a lot of you were subscribed to me last year when I had my old computer that had the uh, uh, fan and everything else, you know, <laughs> hooked into it, all that sort of stuff. But uh, I've got a new, a whole new setup and that's what this video is here to uh, show you. Um, I've also got a spec here that uh, people were asking like what the, the processor is. It's an Intel Core i5 uh, quad core 310 gigahertz processor, um, 8 gigabytes of RAM and it's on the uh, new Windows 7 uh, operating system. So I'm going to spin you guys around here. There you guys go. Sorry it's a little blurry and everything but uh, there's my monitor. I believe it's a 27 inch LED monitor. I've got the Razer Lycosa uh, keyboard here. It's got all sorts of macros and stuff that I don't even use, but you know it's got a it's got a cool feature that allows you to you know just turn on certain keys if you guys want to turn them off you know at night time or during the day. It's got just the WASD if you want just those lit up, and it's also got an option to light them all up. Really, really cool keyboard, and it's also got the little rubber non-slip keys for you know if you're that hardcore into gaming <laughs> and then as far as my mouse goes I've got the Razer Naga mouse it's got tons of macros this was when I used to be a World of Warcraft player it's got 13 or 12 buttons on the side here it's got two buttons right here it's got the mouse slider it's got the two over here I mean it's it's an insane mouse it's got tons and tons of macros if you guys are you know into that sort of stuff if you want a ton of buttons on your mouse and you're into macro and different things it's definitely definitely worth the buy this was like I think it was like 80 bucks or something like that the keyboard was like 80 bucks if that's something you guys are interested in checking out I've just got those two little speakers my collection that my daughter likes to give me and then that subwoofer there um, that's for whenever I'm playing stuff outside of my headset um, and then this is my actual headset here. It's a uh, Turtle Beach uh, headset. This one was also I think like 70 bucks or something like that. Really, really good investment. Definitely worth the uh, the buy. And this is the the crown jewel of them all. This is the inside. I took the plastic case off my computer. It's got a little window and stuff that's like right here. But this is the inside of the computer. Right there. I'm trying to see if I can get you guys in there or not, but right there is the two sticks of uh, four gigabytes of RAM. It's got a Corsair cooler caps that are on the top of it. Keeps the RAM extra cool. There's the processor with these two tubes that are going into this radiator looking thing. That is the liquid cooled system that came with the computer. It's also got an above fan right there. There's the rear view of the, uh, the liquid cooler. Right there is my pride and joy. That's the GTX 560 Ti 2GB graphics card. That one there is the second best that's on the market right now. There's another one above it. It's the 580. But gosh, they wanted like 500 bucks for that thing. And they said that it's a huge jump. But my computer can run dual graphics cards. So I can spend 200 bucks on another one of these and make it just equivalent to the 580 uh, graphics card, which I might end up doing in the long run. This big old thing here is my power supply. It's a 750 watt uh, gamer power supply. Um, really, really good if you guys are running this high end stuff. You have to have a high end power supply or else it'll just pop. And then right there is my hard drive. It's a two terabyte hard drive. Um, the LED lights that are all inside of the fans and stuff here. I don't know if you guys can see the front. Probably not, but down there there's two fans that are lit up blue as well. They go on the front of it. Um, this computer is, uh, um, has the ability, I'm going to spin you guys back around over here now. Uh, yeah, you guys like that? Yeah, my wife got me the nice Modern Warfare 3, uh, t-shirt there. Um, but this computer has the ability to run the uh, top games on the market as of now, like Battlefield 3, uh, Mass Effect 3 on ultra settings. I can max it out and have no frame rate drops whatsoever it's a totally amazing computer and uh yeah so that's what you guys were asking about the computer specs um 
like I said, it's an i5 quad core, uh, eight gigs of RAM, um, two gigabyte graphics card, liquid cooled, all that, all that fun stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. My wife and my kids are actually leaving to California within the hour. They're going to be gone all next week. So, uh, my wife and I have already pre-recorded our Prestige Mode series. We've already pre-recorded our Saints Row the Third series. And we've already pre-recorded the uh, Family Game Nights Let's Play Minecraft. That's already all, uh, you know, pre-recorded, said and done. So that way when they're gone for the week, I can still put my regular videos up Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And then I'll just do my Minecrafts, obviously, as I go. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, uh, schedule won't change. Um, I'm probably going to upload a couple of different games throughout the week. And maybe this weekend, since they're going to be gone. Gives me something to do, since I'm home alone. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so other than that, I hope you guys enjoy the video, and we'll see you guys next time. Later.